my loves, it's Lady Nature here and welcome back to my channel if you're a regular and if you're not a regular and it's your first time coming across my videos, thank you for stopping by and welcome, welcome. If you're interested in my makeup today, um, this is just really my normal makeup routine, my normal Sunday makeup routine. I just really wear minimal face makeup. Um, it's just something that, you know, because I do lead worship at church, so I'm sweating a lot, so I just try not to put a whole bunch of stuff on my face that, that's going to end up getting wiped off. <laughs> and I wear lashes. These lashes are Lily lashes. They're very, 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 very light. Um, these are one of the lighter pairs that I have from Lily. And I got those at Sephora, so if you're looking for Lily lashes, you can go into Sephora and kind of look at them and see which ones you might like because they have very dramatic to very um, minimal. These are very minimal pair that I'm wearing today and they're in the style diamonds I think. And my lip today is Spicy by Morphe. It's a liquid lipstick. Um, li liquid lip stain, liquid lipstick. Um, however you want to classify it, that's what it is. I have it lined with um, what is that lip liner by MAC? Vino? Vino. Is it Vino? I think it's Vino. I'll double check. I lined my lips with this, this, I was call it Vino. And then um, I put my liquid lipstick on and uh, just on my bottom lip and then I blot and then I put a little bit more on and then I take my finger and I kind of blend it out. You know, liquid lipstick to me, some on me anyway, can look kind of chalky. So I stay away from putting a whole lot of that on. And then I use Tiger Lily Blush by Becca on my cheeks. Um, I got my brows. They look a little dark still. I got my brows microbladed. So that's what that is. And um, uh, I'll, let's see, I use Fenty um, Pro Filter Foundation. And in the shade, I think I use 445, I believe. I use that and I also use the, um, what is this? This is the primer. I also use Fenty's primer. And I also use Fenty's um, <sighs> concealer and I use that in a 445. So. Oh, gosh, I'm lying. The concealer is the concealer is in shade 440. So my foundation is is either 450 or 445, but I will also put that down <laughs> in the bottom of the screen. So that's if you're interested in my makeup look today. For those of you who don't know, um, my husband pastors a church here in Corona, California, and we've been in ministry for this year, it'll be 20 years. And so I'm Lady Nadra, I'm his wife. I'm um, some in the church world will call the first lady, but I'm really, you know, I'm his first lady. I'm his only lady, honestly. <laughs> <laughs> like I said, we've been in ministry for 20 years and, you know, have enjoyed every bit of it. Yes, ministry is hard. It's all that is involved in ministry, but um, God has purposed us and, um, you know, put us in this place. And so we don't serve until we die. <laughs> um, I am uh, a beauty channel and I know a lot of pe people think that, you know, getting dressed up to go to church is um, self-serving and I don't know that it, that it isn't. You know what I mean? I like to look nice and I like to um, put forth my best when I go to church. You know what I'm saying? That's what the culture has been. And um, yes, you can come, you know, that scripture, come as you are, doesn't necessarily mean it has nothing to do with what you have on. Either way you know, dressed up or dressed down. It doesn't have anything to do with any of that. That meant the condition of your heart. Yeah, but I do love to dress up. So, um, I really don't just wait till Sunday to dress up. You know, I like dressing up. I like clothes. I just like them, you know. So, therefore, um, I was on Instagram earlier today 
and a barber had put up um, something that said, um, your personality is not the first thing people see. Your hair is. And being a retired hairstylist, that totally spoke to me because that's what I see when I see somebody. When I look at them first, it's not even really what they have on that that, that jumps out at me. It's their hair. <laughs> you know, that's, that's interesting. But I do enjoy, I love all things aesthetically pleasing. It's how I'm made. It's, you know, call me shallow, whatever it is. I like what I like. I'm 51. You know. It don't have nothing to do with you or anybody else. I just like what I like. Um, if that makes me shallow, then shallow it be. I don't know. That's not what I think. I got um, a few new things in, so let me show it to you. Hold on. If you are um, a regular here and you've seen my sunglass video, then you may have seen where I showed you guys these shades. These are um, by Balenciaga. I don't know if you can see all the scratches in them because they are definitely old. And I lost the, the wand. My heart was hurt. I remember the day it came off and I kind of remember where it came off, but I don't see it anymore. So I don't know, maybe I was mistaken, but these would have been perfect with what I have on today. Oh yeah, these would have been good. And I just, my heart is hurt. So anyway, I was looking for something um, similar to these and they're not quite the same color way, but these are, um, they have the pink um, frames and um, they're pretty close. These are actually Tom Ford's and, and listen, so I, what happened was, it, the reason I ended up getting these is I ordered um, the Nugman it's N-E-U-G-H-M-A-N. The Nugman uh, frames from Tom Ford. And I ordered them online. I ordered the kind of like the cream color with the yellow lens. And they kind of made me look like the fly. <laughs> you know, they made me look like the fly. So I was just I was like, put them on, took them off. I knew that I was getting rid of those, taking them back or something. Or selling them if I couldn't take them back. But um, I ended up taking them back and I got these. But I also ordered the, I went into the store because I knew I was going to take those back. I went into Nordstrom um, and I purchased the, the black pair thinking that the black pair would be better for me um, versus that cream color. And I got the black pair with the purple lens and they were beautiful. Then the only thing was... And I mean, the shades are great, but they're more of that aviator style. And that normally doesn't work for me. I just really like the shades. And so I thought that they were going to, they would, you know, I would be able to get away with it. But the lens kind of hit me right in my cheekbones. Um, I said in my, in my, my sunglass um, video, you can go ahead and watch that if you want to. It's my, my entire um, sunglass collection. But they hit me because of my cheekbones are high or fat or whatever you want to call them um, aviators tend to hit me in my um, they're so heavy at the bottom you know in, in the way that they're they're designed they normally hit me in my cheeks and those definitely did that so I ended up gifting those and um, like I said I got these I think they're pretty good they open up these are kind of low on my cheeks as well but because they open up more and the weight of them, or the, the, I don't know if I'm saying that right, the weight or the, the shape is more open down here. These work better for me. But I like these, love them, as a matter of fact. They're nice and light. And the frame, the uh, lenses are not too dark. You know, I don't really like that dark lens, not for me. I guess because I'm already blind. But anyway, um, another pair of shades I got in are these. Oh, these are good. Look at that. Look at that. They're very kind of, you know, unassuming at the at the, the front, um, front view. And the lens is light. They're like a pink um, tint. 
So I wore these today. This is what I had on today. But they have this good cream color on the side with the big Gucci, the two G's on the side. Love. Y'all like these? Uh-huh. They serve two different purposes. So I got two. These are more for when I'm, you know, dressing up. But these other ones are kind of just cash, casual shades, which I did need a pair of casual shades. So, so without further ado, this is um, a video just to uh, let you know kind of what we're, what's going on in faith, keeping faith on the radar, what we're wearing at faith. These are a few few of the people that I've gotten to who are not too camera shy and don't mind sharing. Um, where they got their fabulous fashion. <laughs> this is um, just a video just to highlight a few people that, that you know, wanted to share our faith. So here we go. that I bought two pair, another pair in a different color. Um, and I'm wearing these cute little clear shoes from Aldo. Okay, all right, yeah, yeah. those are cute. Uh-huh, and your nail, your nail polish is yeah. nice. Yeah, and, and, and you know what? I got this cute little ring from Aldo. Oh, let me see. Which is the same place I got my hat. Yeah. Yes, yes my all hair. right, cool. Right, um, and I got the puppy sleeve shirt from, I think this was from, um, about my church flow so this this is a little yes. old, little plaid little shirt some people call it burberry uh -huh, then uh -huh. i got my little what's this my little g stage jeans on okay i got my little richmond john richmond shoes on john richmond you know, all compliments of, of Saks fifth avenue right, the whole nice, outfit there you know nice, so nice. you know how today. we do it you know, fresh, i'm fresh. just trying to be Good old soldier for the Lord. All right, all right. Good morning, Gigi. How you doing? Oh wow! So you got to tell us about your outfit today. Um, I am wearing a Ashley Stewart. Uh huh. Original, I guess. Uh huh. And uh, with gold accessories, little little something something. Uh huh. Your shades are really pretty. Thank you, sweetheart. Mm -hmm. Where are those from? Can we know? Um, we can't know. <laughs> KDs. KDs, okay. I don't know. What accessories. Okay, KDs, okay. KDs accessories. All right, those are very pretty, pretty. And I love your dress. Thank you so much. Happy Sunday. Happy Sunday to you as well. Okay. I love your hair. Thank you. That's pretty. It's hair by Shelly. By Shelly? Yes. Okay. Yes. What's her what's her Instagram? Oh, what is she at? I don't know. Shelly Jones. I don't know what Shelly is. Shelly Jones. Yeah. Shelly Jones. Errol J or something like that. Um I'll know. I'll find, find it. I'll find, find it and post that. it. All right. She's amazing. I love her work. Uh-huh. Yes. I think I have about five units from her now. Oh nice. She's amazing. <laughs> okay. Well, thank you. 
Uh huh. Mom, tell me about your outfit. That's cute, girl. That's cute, girl. So that's a nice cord from from uh, Zara. Uh huh. That's from Zara. Let me see your shoes. Uh huh. Those shoes. Those are uh, Bottega Veneta. Another banana. <laughs> Good morning, Lisa. Good morning, Lisa. You never disappoint. You never disappoint. I'm trying to get invited back over to the to your, you know, to your room, to your station. Oh yeah, oh yeah, yeah. We gotta we gotta come up with another topic, yeah. huh? All right. Part two of the, the, the luxury oh, oh, two. let's do it. Yeah. Let's do it. All right. Okay, so these are from Ear Rehab, I'm sure. Ear Rehab. Uh huh. Ear Rehab. Those are beautiful. Ear Rehab on Facebook and on Instagram. Yes. Okay. Uh -huh. All right. Okay. Tell me about the rest of your outfit. Okay, so I got this little jewel at um, a resale shop in Costa Mesa. I think it's called Twice. Oh, I gotta get back with the put in the link. Okay. Yes. Super cute. Swarovski. Swarovski crystals. Uh huh. Yes. All right. And this dress came from Dallas. A boutique in Dallas. Dallas. That's yes. super cute. Thank nice you. and springy. Thank you. Uh, and comfy, huh? Comfy. Yes, yes. honey. Right, and what's the name of this bag? Uh, this is the LV bag. I'm not sure exactly what the name is, but it's a spring. I love it. I love the orange in there. Uh huh. And my Tory Burch. Tory Burch. <laughs> yes, honey. Yes, honey. Well, thanks for sharing with us. Yes. Hi, Tiffany. Hi. Tell me about your outfit. <laughs> I don't remember where my. I got the dress. Okay. It was very cute. I love the, the little detail on the thank front. Thank you. Thank mm -hmm. you. First, my purse is empty. My mm -hmm. shoes are Steve Madden. Very nice. And your toe color. I love your toe color. Thank you. Uh-huh. <laughs> Tell me how long you have your bag. Um, I got it for Mother's Day. Mother's Day gift. Oh, nice. I actually have shoes to match with the shoes I wanted to wear with the dress and I wanted to wear a dress. Right, right. <laughs> so I'll, yeah, I'll wear the shoes another day. Yeah, another, yeah. Another time with another outfit. Oh, well, super cool. Thanks for sharing with us. Of course. Tell me about your outfit, what you have on today. Okay, so I'll try to remember. I'm wearing uh, denim and coveralls that I got from Macy's. Um, Macy's? Yes, but what I'm going to say, what the real item is, or the eye-catching ear, are these shoes that I picked up thrifting when I was in St. Louis. Mm, and I absolutely turn to the side. love them. They are super cute. Yes. Mm -hmm. And I'm wearing a crossbody bag from Valentino. Um, uh -huh. My cute little Gucci scarf. Yes. And my cute little, hey, you can't go wrong with the hat, right? Right, right. <laughs> We're twinning today with the hat. Yep. Huh? So that's it. All right, very cute. And you got your Gucci belt, too. Yeah, my Gucci belt, yeah. <laughs> yeah, nice accessories. <laughs> Tell me about your outfit. You got a nice hat on. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me about I'm it. I'm ready to go on vacation with this hat. Oh, yeah? Yes. <laughs> that is so old. Uh -huh. I had this hat when I lived in Long Beach, and that was 30 years ago. Oh, really? Uh -huh. Okay. But well, you look pretty. Thank you. Let me see your nails. Those are pretty. Nice. You know, you know me? I'm going to always be me. Uh -huh. You know? I pamper me. Hey, that's right, that's right. Pop it. So you've been married for how long? 65 years this October. This October. And you, wow. you said you've been pampering you all this time, right? Because yeah. he loved to pamper me when I was young, so I'm still young. <laughs> <laughs> that's right. But the biggest test is that God will meet you at that place. God is not super spiritual like you are and like so many people are. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you're at, if you go to Faith Fellowship, don't run from me when, when I come to you with my camera. I just want to show, you know, share with the people. 
just want to share with the people. That's all. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give me a big fat thumbs up. Like, subscribe, comment, do all those things here on YouTube. Go follow me over on Instagram at Nadra.Williams. And I hope to see you in the next one.